What's going on, y'all? JT here with a quick video. So a couple of you guys wanted to see these actual tires and wheels on the Traxxas Max. So I have the Proline Jeep Rubicon body on there, and this actually looks really good. It looks better than what I thought it was going to look. And I actually have the new Proline um, Chevy truck body. I think it's... Uh, I can't remember which one it is. I just bought it maybe a couple of weeks ago, but I'm going to put that on there as well, and that's going to look pretty mean. But I did want to at least get this out and run this for you guys with these tires and wheels on it so that you can see um, how it kind of looks. Stock, we still got the stock servo, and I do have a 2085. So if you have the 2085X, I probably would recommend that if you want some stronger steering. But it does stare, of course, when you get on speed just a little bit. And these tires do give you... Plenty of grip here. It's been a minute since I have driven this. Actually, I got my SMC LiPo in here. Ooh, bow. Oh, look at that. And I didn't have my body on her all the way. So we're gonna keep driving it. I had some little um <laughs> some little um wheel nuts on there to hold the body down. And I probably didn't secure them down enough, but I probably should have put some washers on it. I lost those little screws that Proline has on there. But anyway, this is just about trying to run this here. One of my body down there, right? <laughs> I do suggest if you do put these on from just driving it right here. It does have a bit of oversteering or you guys see that and I have to actually have the throttle to do a sharper turn I would suggest playing with your suspension some if you want some sharper turning in it but then you don't want it too sharp because then your truck's going to be flipping all over the place but yeah so we are running this with uh this body off of it <laughs> They're performing well, though. I know some people were saying it was too much grip. It's not really because they're not really soft like some of the other tires that I've run and some of the other belted tires I've run. So, of course, they're not ballooning. And, of course, when you run a tire for the first time, they're going to have a little bit more grip than after you actually run it and wear some of that first layer off of it. I really need to put this body on. I think I lost one of those uh, Proline body clips. I'm like, uh. Yeah, my light's still flickering on the front. I think I got to lose something in there. I don't know. All right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this on the street real quick and um, show you guys a quick run there. Ah, so just to show you guys some body damage, ah, my body's kind of, I can touch that paint up. Um, but that's what I get for trying to just, I couldn't find all of these uh, screw-ons for it. That actually just came unscrewed. I didn't have that screw down in there. Uh, deep enough but that's basically what just happened here with this but anyway i'm never going to find uh those the one that's for the back that's lost but i still have them there in the front so that's all good so let me try to get this body at least somewhat secured on and we're gonna take it on the street real quick all right y'all i kind of somewhat got this body on here <laughs> all right try these on here real quick make sure no cars are coming up behind me Their body wasn't so off. Put the car up the street real quick. We'll let them by. Give me just a second. Let this car by. Dang, y'all. She drove like all the way over there. <laughs> I have no idea why she did that. But anyway. Yeah, this is, these are pretty good. They're performing a lot better. Like I said before, I'm gonna race this car up the street real quick, hit the bump. <laughs> Gotta race them up here. Performing a lot better than what I thought they would. I know they perform good on um, the Outcast, and that's that TSM kicking in. But with some minor adjustments, these were, these would be good on here too. So I'll try them on some of my Team Corrali cars and stuff next, but I did want to at least get this out for you guys um, and run them. And actually, um, I have order that just came in since I like these kind of a lot. 
and I went ahead and I ordered the uh, short course ones and the 10 scale monster truck ones as well. So I'll have a uh, probably just a quick look at those so you guys can see that. But these are good. I think Power Hobbies really has a winner with these, in my opinion. Uh, I actually would really think they do. They got a really good winner with these. So, so far, so good. These do look a little bit bigger. Of course, they're bigger and a little bit heavier than the Max Tire. So you just consider that when you buy them, but they actually fit on here good. And you guys saw that they actually are performing well. So with some minor adjustments, this will actually be pretty good. So anyway, guys, put your comments down below. You guys know I always do look through those, even though I don't respond to everyone. Don't forget to like, because that helps me out. And subscribe. And if you guys are looking for JTRC t-shirts and stuff, there is a link in the description below. And you guys also know our author books. If you don't know that, you can actually click the link in the description below and see that as well. So anyway, guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching.